Pittman. Hollis Pittman. My colleague here is Murray. How you doing? <laughs> you know, I always say a fellow hitching needs a ride. <laughs> What'd you say your name was? He hadn't. Tucker. If you don't mind, where is your destination? Headed to work, just south of the city. Well, if you got a nine to five, and, and you're gonna be there every day, then- Murray. What, what Murray here is saying is, is where's your car? Yeah. And what I'm saying is, is I think we both know. We do? Murray, does the name Richie Denson ring a bell for you? the skill, but you need to have it in your heart. Oh, I got plenty of heart. Don't worry about that. Hey, Terry. This guy over here. Who is he? That's Richie Denson. So-called fight promoter. Promoter, huh? Hey, what can you do for us? Well, let me put it to you this way. Would you rather be a boxer or a washed-up tomato can boxing oranges in the North End? Well, you know the answer to that. But you know we need a fight. So what are we gonna do? I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You go take a shower. Let's cut the long division here. I work for Denson. He pays me, and I do things for him. Second, your turn. Crime wave. Name's Richie Denson. You don't mind, I'd like to run something by you. You know a fighter by the name of Stevens? Victor Stevens. Yeah, of course I know. What about him? Like to fight him? Are you serious? Is Richie LaMontagne cruiserweight champ? Yeah, I'm serious. And you can set that up? Yes, I can. But I'd like to know that I'll be gaining from it. You see, you and me, we look at boxing a little differently. At any rate, what I'm saying is, what can you put on the line? So you mean you want me to better myself? Yeah, something like that. Because if you don't want to lace up your shoes, then... No, that's not it. Just, uh, I ain't got much to put up. Well, how'd you get here today? Did you take the bus? No, I drove. There you go. Yeah. I'll put mine down, you put yours. Mm. We'll go car for car. Look, you want this fight or not? Yeah, yeah, of course. 
It's all set now. I'll take care of my end. You take care of the other. Yeah, he set me up with a chance to fight Victor Stevens. Hey, I know that guy. Did he? Uh, didn't he? Did he knock a guy out of the ring, Rory? Right? Do you remember what we talked about? Forget it. Just keep quiet. So, Tucker. You may not know this, but Denson has had his eye on you for some time now. He calls it reaping his crop of cultivation. He farms? Murray, I told you not to talk. Now, get out of the car. Hollis, we're moving. Get out. Come on, you serious? I, it's cold out. I, 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 look, look, okay, I'll be quiet, right? Shh, shh, nice, okay. Out, you derelict. Fuck me. Like I was saying, Denson saw something he liked, and he made an investment. What do you mean? I don't follow. Well, let me spell it out for you. The three fights that you won, he fixed them. After the three, he approached you about fighting Stevens, ready to uh, reap his crop of cultivation. He fixed the fights, so my record will look good enough to fight Stevens, huh? Right. Why do you want me? He figured young kid on a streak, publicity, it looked good. And he thought you'd take the fix. The fix? That's where I come in. He sent me to make you an offer to throw the fight and take a fall in the fifth. But I knew you were a straight shooter, a do-it-yourself fighter. So I figured that you wouldn't go for it. Plus, I didn't think you were good enough to beat him. When you got knocked out in the fifth, well, it just so happened to be the same round as Denson planned. So he thought I took the fix? Yeah, and he made good money from it. So the word on the street is I threw it. He's working on another fight, and he wants you to win it. Is it a fix? Look, Richie is about as crooked as a set of intestines. So yeah, it's gonna be a fix. You tell me I don't box anymore, so I'm not interested. It's not an issue whether you want to or not. You signed the contract when you lost the fight. But I didn't take no fix. He doesn't know that. Look, do you want to beat some karaoke undercard for the rest of your career? Fuck it. You got me off my feet. I won some fights, got noticed. That's right. You don't think I've been down that road before? In your shoes, I owned your shoes. You? I broke them in. And don't think you'll be the last. Richie will use you up and be on to the next fighter faster than you can take out your mouth guard. You're no different than me. Today you're his.
Same.